What's up, y'all? Continuing my trend of playing old games, here's uh, Rise of the Tomb Raider. This is actually the last Tomb Raider game that I finished. Um, and I say that because since then I have tried to play Shadow of the Tomb Raider and uh, Tomb Raider Underworld. Tomb Raider Underworld I, I kind of gave up on because it it just has issues. Um, like it'll crash and it runs like like ass. And uh, Shadow of the Tomb Raider, I made the mistake of putting it on, um, what's it called? Um, uh, Deadly Obsession difficulty, I think. And so like every time you die, you have to restart the entire level basically, unless you get to a checkpoint. But the problem is, when you start the game, you you don't actually get to a point where there is a checkpoint for like the first three levels uh, where you can go to a camp and save. Once you actually get to a point where there is a camp, then you don't have to start or rather then you don't have to repeat entire levels of the game. You just start over from the, the camp. But uh, by the time I got to that point, I was just like fed up with the game. Um, somewhere around the level where it floods everywhere and destroys that that area i think like after you get to guatemala is when it actually lets you use camps so i did finally get to a point where i can progress in the game but i stopped caring so we're going to turn the music volume down here a lot and then this is all good subtitles I don't know how well this is going to run. I mean, there's no excuse for it to not run swimmingly. Simulation. Um, Graphix 12. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that as well. You suck. <sighs> Among other reasons. I'm going to regret this. I, I know it already. Among other reasons. It's on Game Pass, and so I never played this on console, so I want to try to get the achievements for it. What makes someone reach beyond the boundaries of human experience? Kind of drives me to do a lot of these, the unknown. these games. As children, we question the world around us. That I've already we played. Learn, we accept, and gradually we lose our capacity for wonder. But some do not. The explorers, the seekers of truth. It is these pioneers who define the future of mankind. The others, they're done. No amount of money is going to get them through those mountains. The lost city's up there, somewhere. That's going to be a hell of a climb. I'm not turning back. You should stay here with them. Not a chance.
a bad feeling this is not going to run well at all. It's amazing. But the snow coming off those peaks is a bad sign. You you would think when you spend almost $2000 on a GPU Sarah, that the um, we'll have a good view of the valley from you, can, you can game oh. without fear of That's any amazing. performance issues, but thanks to these AAA games, it's just this not the case. Crazy. I know, but I have a good feeling about this. I remember, uh, when this game came out in what, like 2014 or something? 2015? This, uh, textured deformation. was uh, kind of a big deal at that point in time. Laura, are you all right? Jonah, I'm here. I'll climb down there and get you. No. It's We're going to pretend that didn't happen. Just going to edit that out. Was holding the wrong direction on the um no. the thing it's too dangerous i can climb back up are you sure just stay put uh this i need to turn this off because it's going to kill the battery I, I wish some of these games have an option where you can turn on like light vibration so it doesn't vibrate all the time but most games are like this where it's just it's either on or off They change Jonah's model every game significantly. Looks like we gotta go through. So I remember he doesn't look like that in one or three. <laughs> Not bad. If the weather turns, we can pull up in this cave. Do you really think we'll find this lost city? I know this is a long shot. But that old tracker said he saw ruins up in these mountains. Storm's getting closer. We have a couple hours at most. Are we going to, um... Should be enough time. We're almost to the top. It's it's not what do you call it? Not Shangri La. Maybe it is. What do you think? We're close to something, Jonah. I can feel it. Just as last stretch to the top. Alright. Doesn't she say that in every new Tomb Raider game? Like at least fifteen times. Assuming that you have to dodge anything, I don't see how I possibly could have dodged that. Uh, 
I've noticed also, because I've played uh, 2013 recently, like, parts of it, this super shaky camera mo movement is, like, intentional to, uh, throw you off. Until this collapses. Am I supposed to jump or something? Oh, okay. Suddenly, she doesn't have two ice picks. I got, I got you, Laura. Can you hear me? Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna pull you back up. Oh, fuck. There. Over there. Quick. Swing me to the other side. Okay. Here goes. Oh, are we doing one of these? Okay. These are always like the worst parts of the Uncharted games. Except in Uncharted, it would... It would be like the entire level is collapsing and we're not going to give you any idea which, you know, which platforms are safe until they already start falling. Um, I've noticed they do this also, like, they'll start out the Tomb Raider games really easy to give you this false sense of security when you choose super hard mode. And then, like, three chapters in, you realize, like, oh, I shouldn't have done this. cruelty of life that we're all too swiftly taken from it. We age, we decay, we die. But what do we leave behind? Bones? dust what of the soul does it endure beyond our earthly existence i believe it does a truth lies at the heart of many myths and stories a truth not of science but 
something more profound. The key to unlocking everlasting life. Found the next piece to the puzzle. But I'm not alone in this search. They're following me, watching my every step. I know them by name now. Trinity. An ancient, violent sect with designs on controlling the future of humanity. I must proceed carefully for the sake of my family. If anything were to ever happen to Lara or Anna, I could never forgive myself. doing here? I saw the gutter press was attacking you again. I thought you could use some company. No lies. Were you followed? Followed? Of course not. What's going on? I think I found the tomb. Oh, you can't be serious. The myth of the prophet is real. Dad was right. Lara, your father was unwell. No. He was close to a great discovery, tangible evidence of the immortal soul. I loved Richard. I would have married him if he'd asked. But he was a broken man. I don't want to see you end up like him. But Anna, he was right. It was everyone else who was wrong. Tombs in Syria. Syria? Oh, God, Laura, no. This is madness. Get your life sorted. Go home to the manor. You know I can't go back there. But this obsession ruined your father. I saw something. Something I... I can't explain. Now I understand what Dad was going through. Is she high as fuck or like, what's the deal with, it's uh... Fairy tales. Anna. Nonsense. Whatever her name is. Look Don't at her go eyes. Down this road. <laughs> you know where it leads. I don't think that happens when you're crying. I'm pretty sure, like, me now. I'm going to find the prophet's tomb. It, <laughs> it's like either drugs or no sleep. Hey, we're heading into a war zone now. We better be sure about this. We're close. There should be an oasis in the canyon just ahead. You're wasting your time. There's nothing out here. Just keep driving, please. It's your money. The graphics in this game are weird. Like it, they simultaneously look good and look outdated. Something isn't right. Oh, that's just local militia. You told someone, didn't you? They, they paid better than you. You <laughs> Shit, they weren't supposed to shoot at us. Get us out of here. Shit, shit. No, no, no.
I love the trope in action games where, like, literally everything has to explode all the time. Um, it's a lot harder for a car to explode like that, like that than Hollywood and games make it seem. Just kind of a silly trope. Like, no turning back. It has to be here. A lot has to go wrong for the fuel line to catch on fire. Uh, which one am I? Can you not even save the game? I haven't tried, but... There was something in Dad's research about this. It was said the Prophet's tomb was hidden in the cliffs above one of the Forgotten Cities. Legend speaks of... Yeah, conveniently marked by yellow paint. To rest. That's totally natural rock color, okay? That's not paint. Looks like a up on the cliff. Icon, detailed and inlaid with gems. It looks Byzantine. Looks Byzantine, perhaps 10th century. Okay, yeah. we can read. Could this really be it? I like how little gear she comes pre prepared with compared to even the older versions of Tomb Raider. She's like, I got a pistol and one glow stick and a little walkie talkie and an ice pick thing, and that's enough for me. Incredible. Some kind of marker. I can't quite make out the translation. I think this game was also pushing texture uh, technologies at the time, too, Office. with the shade. Shade? I mean, this layered of shaders. Uh, like how she had scratches That's and dirt right. and crap all over her. That's kind of commonplace now, but I mean, it's been 10 years. Hmm. Seems to be a map of some sort, but I can't quite read the words. Oh, I forgot about that. Can I save here? Because I actually got a... Okay, he's shown here performing healing miracles. Dad's notes mentioned this. Who's he? Jesus? God? Who is, who is it supposed to be? I forget his name. He, I mean, he's in the game later on. These are the miracles of the prophet of Constantinople. Oh, the prophet of Constantinople. murdered by order of Trinity. Okay. Uh, save? No, you... Oh, wait. I didn't realize it, but um, this port was made by Nix's... Is there a different thing on each side of this? Some sort of marker. Okay, that makes sense. Script, but I it's realistic. Quite make it out. It's the prophet speaking with a foreign army. He convinced them to lay down their weapons. What about this stuff? He led his followers. Can I level up above my current understanding? Ooh. I'm not gonna go through there yet because I'm not sure if uh still no sign of her. I don't think she survived the crash. Alright, let's go. 
Constantine wants to breach the tomb before sundown. They're after the tomb. I've got to find it before them. Hmm, my Greek is still a little rusty, but it's pointing to something hidden. Nearby. She just mastered like five years of, of classical college education in like three seconds in a tomb. Okay, so you can't read every slide. That's right. It, bro if you have the leg strength to climb you had the leg strength to kick down a wall it's amazing if only dad could have seen this I like how every time one of these Tomb Raiders goes to something, it, it has to collapse around them. But I mean, that's, that's part of the genre, so there's no reason to criticize it. Although, to be fair, I think uh, the only reason anything ever collapsed around Indiana Jones was because the Nazis blew it up around him. Let's go. Damn it. Come on. Scorpion was just climbing on air or uh, walking, I guess it's the correct word. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, fuck that. I mean, I, I already would have died like 15 times, but. I would have just turned around and sat there if I found a cave full of giant scorpions. And giant rats. Giant rats, I don't mind, but the scorpions can kill you. <laughs> I mean, a rat can kill you too, but that would be an achievement if a rat killed you. For you and for the rat. I'm surprised that survivor mode actually enables the this. Uh, has received word that the prophet's whatever vision. Building a great tomb. A the prophet mural. slain by the order of Trinity. Yeah. That's a giant that spear was thing. Close. What is that? A waste of blood on this? Is 
She has a weird pistol, too. It's not even a good handgun. Like, pistol, whatever the technical term is. Oh, it's a 1911 or something. It looked weird. It looked like it was a Ruger. They're blasting their way in. Shitty little Ruger Mark II or something. Need to shoot this thing down. Okay, so actually, let's make sure there's nothing else here first. I think once you're familiar with how these uh, platforming puzzles work in one AAA game, then you've pretty much seen everything that all of them will ever have to offer. So, like, no doubt that exact same type of puzzle is in Last of Us 1 and 2, I'm sure. Or at least the first game where Ellie can't swim. I say I'm sure as if I haven't played the game a thousand times. Stealth mode, like a press this button to crouch. Oh, I vaguely remember this. Stunning. We made it, Dad. I think some dudes are going to show up in this room. There's one. Got to find a way to get up higher. Can you not dive? Maybe I can raise the water. Uh, I mean, I, there's also the fact that I've played this game before, so. I mean, I do loosely remember some of these puzzles. Pretty sure you get the bow and arrow before you have to fight any people here. Might be the next room, but I vaguely remember there being two chambers on the side of the room here. Ancient 
My lord, what you say is impossible. I myself drove a spear into the prophet. Um, I think the prophet was touched by the hand of God or something. Like, basically, like in Lost, um, was like touched by Jacob, basically. <laughs> Sex coins. It's like the, okay. all west inside. Yeah, so I was right about the dudes. <laughs> I had a feeling stepping on that pressure plate thing was a bad idea, but I don't think you could have avoided it. at the head of a small army of the faithful armed and ready and i have good news we have located the tomb of the prophet we were at <sighs> got um, to raise the water i think jumping on this thing raises the water we're just attacking this Did I not? Never mind. Oh, it keeps lowering. Um, you have to jump on the top of it. Can you really not get up there? This is the part where I no longer remember what to do.
and they somehow magically didn't see her in Hollywood fashion. Set the charges! I remember thinking all the uh, After all this time, the gear on on all the characters looked really good. It still does. Inside. It's just right. the textures would be better, like in twenty twenty three. Open it. Or worse, possibly Careful. much worse. Who knows? It could be extremely dangerous. Is that Clancy Brown? I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play games with me. You led us to this place. Look, it was empty when I got here. There was no body and definitely no artifact. Strategy. Can I take cover, please? Holy frame drops. <laughs> What's this? These these scenes must be pre-rendered at like twelve frames per second. Croft Manor was actually in this game. Oh, it's not. It's just a cutscene. Themselves, Trinity. They tried to kill me. What the hell is going on here? You're starting to scare me. The tomb was empty. I think they were looking for the divine source. The, the artifact your father was after? There's more. I found this symbol in the tomb. I knew I'd seen it before. It was driving me insane. That's when it hit me. I saw it here in one of Dad's books. <laughs> Textbook Indiana Jones. Course. The lost city of Katesh, said to have disappeared in Siberia sometime in the 12th century. Legend says that on the eve of the invasion by the Mongol horde, it sunk beneath. What's that to do with the Prophet's artifact? The same symbol. <laughs> Laura. <laughs> if the divine source is hidden in the ruins of Katesh, waiting to be found, then I have to go. To Siberia? Are you kidding me? Just think. If this thing could really unlock the secret of immortality, it would... It would change everything. Sickness, suffering, death, gone. 
Are you listening to yourself? Jonah, we've been through so much together. You know there's more out there. This could be real. I don't care if it's real. I've lost too many friends. I don't want to lose you too. Dad never made the connection to Katash. He gave up everything for this. Including you. Stop blaming yourself for what happened. He made his own bed. I can't give up on him. Not now. It's all I have. No, it isn't. If you stayed still for five minutes, maybe you'd see that. How does this place still have electricity if he's dead? She's certainly not paying the bills. I don't know, maybe if you're rich, you don't have to pay utility bills. You just like own the electricity for your property. Maybe it has a generator or something. source is real. We've got to find it first. Siberia it is then. 